I was logging with my dad and I lost my axe. Normally we just use the axe for um, driving wedges. But anyways, I lost it in the woods and in the snow so I can't find it. So, but I have this one. My dad got this one somewhere. It's obviously got a broken handle. But the handle profile is really nice. So I'm going to try to copy this handle profile onto a new handle. I have a piece of ash and I'm going to turn that into the new handle. Why ash and not something like hickory? Well, I have bunches of ash and I, and I don't have any hickory, so that's why. <clears throat> so I have my handle blank traced out, or bandsawed out. I traced it out then cut it on the bandsaw. My batteries were low, so I don't have pictures of cutting that. I do. I cut three of the sides, and then I glued one or double-sided taped one side back on, so it sat down flat on the bandsaw. And then cut the last contour. So I cut. Uh, how did I cut? I cut this side first, turned it this way, cut the two sides, and then glued a side back on, and then cut the back. So that's how I did it. And now I'm going to get out the spoke shave and shave this down to match that handle. So I've got this fit well enough. It's not perfect, but it's pretty good. So I'm going to lube this up with linseed oil and um, drive it on. I've got a good curl coming up around, so that was a fairly shallow taper. So now this is on pretty darn tight, even with this is this is on really tight, even without the wedge. So now I get to drive the wedge in, and um, yeah, there's a bit of a gap here, but on the other side is closed in, so it's the, you know the shape of the eye is a lot wider on this end. So um, it is what it is.
maybe could have had a slightly fatter wedge, but that's still jammed in there pretty tight. And then also one other benefit of the linseed oil is when linseed oil polymerizes, it expands. So that should help this expand. So here we have the ax and the handle. I might do a little bit more shaping down at the back here and probably a little sanding along, smooth it out. But that's the, the general idea. So the handle is pretty much done. Just need a little bit more sanding and a coat of linseed oil. There's a little rough spots where the uh, grain pulled out using the uh, spoke shave, because that happens if you try to take too thick of a cut or against the grain. And with this many curves, it's really hard to get everything going in the right direction. There we have it. <clears throat> One finished axe handle. <clears throat>